Now let's make the requests and the API calls using the postman.com. We have seen this lovely friend, this uh, website. It's very uh, important and used for API calls and queries. For that, I have uh, signed up before and I will click on launch postman and I am logging in. Now I will click on create a request and this is the, the request page. We select the get because we are going to get the response. We get the data from the server of the, uh, the, the movie db.org. Okay, guys. So let's start by making the queries into the postman. Let's go to our uh, this page and let's select copy and see how it will works okay i will click send we have requested this uh, this uh, movie and dash slash 550 this is an api calls for the uh, for the movies that we have searched for now let's change this into one of the these in the documentations let's find the movies we see we see here in the left side the movies so in order to get details uh, in the in the details section we can use this parameter movie and the movie id the movie id which is uh, which is here is 550 and we use the api key now let's go and get get uh, the latest movies that we have we see here in the get method and we are using slash movie slash latest i will copy latest here and i will go to the postman and here we see that the movie id is 550 i will remove it because i don't need a one a one single movie i need the the latest movies releases and we have the question mark here and the API key is the same as before. We click on send and here is the result that we will obtain from this request. Okay, guys. Now, latest. Okay. We will get all of these. all of these responses now we get an object now let's get the popular the popular will return an object of and a result of an array of objects so a movie list result object so we have many movies for that i will copy popular and i will remove the latest to the popular and i will change it and click send as I thought, as I see, uh, we saw in the previous videos how to uh, to configure that. We have here. Let me check popular and movie. This is the request movie popular. Okay. So in the previous videos, we have seen how to configure the results, but. As I told you, in these videos, we are going to make with uh, the retrofit uh, using the retrofit library, and we are going to make a more advanced application using the MVV um, architecture and making a professional app that allows the user to search and query for results. Now, as the documentation said for us, we will get a page integer this is the page number one and we have a total results of 10,000 and the total pages 500 so we are displaying a one page of this 500 pages this is the uh, thing that we have not lectured in the previous videos because we didn't we have the basic things inside this API now we need to understand that this request here is a page 
only one page of uh, of this 500 pages now we are getting the record the results as uh, here at the first movie this is the first movie let me check this is the first movie the second movie is in all homes or sorry the first movie is in all homes the second movie till now it is the welcome to sudden death the third movie also in the same way and so on so we are displaying around 18 movies for the first page but what about the second page the third page and how can we can access these pages and display the other results for this uh, and allow the user to access more and more results and display more uh, things and more results the trick here is getting the page. So how to get the page we are going to find with ours with, uh, with uh, together how to get the list of pages or how to access the pages inside the query. Okay, guys. So in order to access the pages here, as I told you, we need to this to set the page number two three five and so on till 500 so we have a request result of 500 pages but till now in the, uh, as we see in the previous videos in the, in the previous uh, uh, project we have accessed only one page so in order to access uh, uh, this the second page or what uh, or a specific page we add for the requests and add sign above and page equal to two let me check and let's send and here we go we are on the page number two displaying another 18 results so we have here battlefield 20 2025 and after we collided and the scoop movies and also till here okay guys these are the new movies now let me access page number three and here we go we have page number three and we go so on page number 50 in the same way page 100 and these are different different uh, pages 100 103 and so on so in this way we can access the pages inside our uh, json requests and querying the request i will copy this i will copy this request also and save it for the later use for our application android in android state so searching or access accessing a page number and we put here in the same as before okay so the add and sign and the page equal to one we can access the page number one okay guys till now we are doing very very well let me go and add the search and the search queries and discover the query for uh for the search i will copy this and i will go here and paste it let this query sorry i need to add the api key the api key here and i will select it and i will paste it and click on send so this query will give me a detail for uh, details for their um, a movie called jack reacher so we see here that the movie here is a jack reacher and the original title jack reacher january ids and backdrop path the the image and the poster path this is so if i copy this i will copy it sorry i will go first in order to get the images i will uh, get the image from get image 
in order to get the image i will need to movie id sorry the images okay i will go to the getting started images and here is a general image i will copy it also getting getting image and this is the request i will replace this with with the name here okay and the request of the jack reacher i will copy this and i will paste it into the link so here is our results this is the jack reacher movie poster if we need the backdrop this is the backdrop I will remove it and this is the backdrop so in this way we are getting the poster path and the image for the title and we have uh, details that we are going to parse through the application so when the user click on the ID uh, on the uh, sorry on the movie item it will get another activity displaying all of these results so let's move to the next step in order to get all data into inside inside android studio android studio